Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl. I am Adina Leanne, better known as Mistress underscore Glam Fairy. And today I'm here with my box that I won with my giveaway stuff from Glam Mammy Artistry. I hope I'm saying that right. She also has a YouTube channel, but she hasn't sent me the link yet. Hopefully she would have done that before I post this video. So if you'd like to see what I have in this here box and also the stuff I have on this here face, please stay tuned. So any of you that know me know that I do my videos once. I don't rehearse. I don't go back and redo it if I muff it up. So if I muff it up, it's just muffed up. So what I wanted to do was I wanted to talk about what I have on my face first. Then I'm going to go into this box. So you see here I have my trusty dusty scissors. And then I have not broken the seal yet. So it's still on here. Um... I'm gonna open this on camera and hopefully I'm able to find the seam because she's got this wrapped up like it's Fort Knox. Hope oh, I can get any. So first thing I wanted to do was put on my glasses so I can see and then I'll tell you about what I have on my face. Now to start off, what I did was I have a couple, actually it's like three of the Pro Conceals from LA Girl that I mixed together. But don't ask me why. But the reason I do that is because I can't seem to get a really good color, just one that I like. So I have Fawn, Warm Sand, and I have Cool Tan. And what I did was I put them all in this little container here. So I mixed them all up. And that's what I use for my highlight. Then for I do, well actually I do my brows first. But you all already know that I use the um, Color Mates from the Dollar Tree. This is my eyebrow powder of choice. Now, I do have this uh, Maybelline Color Tat Tattoo Studio Brow Gel. Um, if anyone knows where I can purchase the Auburn color, because I really prefer a more brownish, reddish brown um, brow, I can't find it anywhere. All I found is dark brown. They have like almost a black. Um, I can't find the auburn. Is it that popular? So I can't find it. I'm getting frustrated. Oh, and they have the, a blonde color that is not going to show on my face. So if anyone knows where I can get that, could you please point me in the right direction? So after I do my brows, then I do my highlight concealing. Then I just got this a couple of days ago. It is the Maybelline Dream Satin Liquid foundation and this is in caramel and I really like the coverage so far I just this is my first time using it today I just broke the seal on it so far I like it oh do you see this while I was taking pictures of my granddaughter this morning for her first day of school a mosquito mosquitoes were out there attacking me like I was a full-grown buffet so they got me here and I got like around my ankles I had probably like 15 bites and I got some like on the back of my arm I'm an itchy mess okay so back to off of the ADD train and back to the makeup. So for contouring today, I use the Black Radiance True Complexion Contour Palette. And then for my blush, I use the Black Radiance Artisan um, Color Baked Blush in Rich Peach. Then for highlight, I use the Makeup Revolution Skin Kiss Peach Kiss Highlighter. Then on my eyes, I went... Um, palette crazy. So I started off with uh, basing my eyes with the Ruby Kisses uh, Magic Primer. Yeah, that's what that is. Magic Primer. Um, then I used some of the Too Faced Sweet Peach palette. Actual, um, we need to unlock the oh, Jesus. First. I used the Bad Habit Inferno palette and I also used the Bad Habit Athena palette. And then I used some of J-Cat Beauty's Melrose Avenue um, 24 eyeshadow palette. It has really beautiful colors, but I only use this shadow here on this look. And then I also mix that color with Blinkle, which is also from J Cat Beauty. This is number 102 Tangerine Light. So I mix those two on my uh, the shadow that's in the middle of my eye, and then I blended out the shadows from the rest of the palettes. Um, I can't tell you what kind of look this is. If it's grunge or if it's a uh, Halo, 
I don't know what it is, but I liked it, so that's what I use. Um, oh, and also what I do is I have a lipstick that's by e.l.f. This is Posh. Now, I do have this that I use for my lips, and I keep it separate over here because I know this is probably some weirdo stuff, but this is the one that I use on my lips. Put it right back over there. And this is the one I use on my eyes, and I keep this in the eyeshadow base drawer that I have because I had this thing about saliva, and I want whatever's on my lips on my eyes, so I keep that one in there so that I don't make, I know I'm probably some sort of weirdo. Um, Cause like I see people using their liquid lipsticks on their eyes. I hope they're not mixing. I just, uh, I can't. All right. So then for liquid liner today, I use the LA Colors uh, liquid liner, I, liquid eyeliner. This isn't just some black, as you know. This is my favorite. I can't seem to keep these. I ran out of them really quickly. Um, on my lips, I should have probably looked it up. I'm not going to do it right now. But I have the clean colors, which you know are my favorite, 1634 and 1614. So I use 1614 in the middle, and then I use 1634 on the outside, and then I my 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 to get it to the color I wanted. And then I use the Scandalize uh, Mascara from Rimmel. And then, oh baby. I don't know if you all go in five below like I do. I probably need to stay out of there and Dollar Tree because I could probably buy a whole bunch of stuff if I wasn't shopping in Dollar Tree and five below. Anyway, they have this Smoke and Mirrors Setting Spray. And uh, I really love it. it. This here is really my favorite right now. I don't know. It doesn't say if it's mad or anything like that, but it's smoking mirrors, and this is from, um, I get it from Five Below. So that is the stuff that I used on my face. Okay, so let's now get into the real reason why you're here. I know you really weren't concerned about that. You wanted to see what I got, which I do too. Um, Glamammy Makeup Artistry. She is a YouTube she does have a YouTube, but like I said, she hadn't sent me the link yet. So I'm hoping she's going to do that before I post this video. But she's also on Instagram. I've been following her for some time. And she's a really gorgeous young lady. Uh, I call her my little sis. You know, I adopt people for the most part and call them my little sis and stuff like that. Because the beauty community can be kind of fierce, uh, mean, ugly. Beauty can be ugly. But I don't think that it should be. I think that there's enough love for everybody to go around. I don't like this thing that Instagram has with this algorithm where they're limiting people. Uh, I'm a 50 plus blogger, so, you know, I really don't get any type of, uh, you know, play or something. I feel like these braids are about to fall down or something. I got the little wrap thing around it. I put these braids up in like 10 seconds because I was going swimming on my staycation. <laughs> I did go swimming. But anyway... And forgive me because I have such bad ADD. But anyway, back to Instagram. I think that they have enough people with 2 billion followers. And then they have the people with 4 followers. And I just think it's kind of foul. But, you know, I don't own Instagram. You know, they don't care listening to us anyway. So, anyway, back to what I was talking about. Back to my box. <laughs> I got the box. Um, she had a giveaway, and um, she said it's some of her faves. So I'm not quite certain what's in here. She didn't tell me. She just said the winner is. If you go over, please follow her page. I will put the link of it like right here, right in this area, right here, right, right, right there. So this is her Instagram page that I got like right here. And um, so please go over and follow her. She, like I said, she's got a small Instagram page like I do. And, you know, we all trying to support one. And if you're really trying to support someone, you know, I mean, sometimes we just don't have enough time to really be on social media like we would like to. But every once in a while, I try my best to go around and like a whole bunch of people's pictures because I'm supporting them. I'm not following people just to get my numbers up uh, because my numbers have basically been the same for about a year now. And what can I say? So anyway, I'm going to get into actually opening the box. So let's put these glasses on so I can see what I'm doing and hopefully I don't cut my finger off with these scissors. So I got my box. What day did I get the box? I believe I got it last Tuesday. But I said I was going to do an unboxing video, so I guess I could walk and chew gum at the same time and open while I'm running my mouth. So I said I was going to do a video to un open it on camera. I really like doing that. I like sharing my goodies um, with my what I call my friends and family on social media. I don't 
like same followers and subscribers and stuff like that um, because if you are following or subscribe to me you kind of like family to me because it's so very few people and I sometimes I may not be able to I'm gonna have carpal tunnel from opening all this girl what you do you wrapped up this thing like it was Fort Knox for real so I'm into the box and she's got bubble wrap and stuff like that but she has a card in here, and you all already know that I am such a freaking wimp. I'm a freaking wimp. I hate that I'm a wimp. So I hope she don't have anything sappy in here, because I'll start crying. <laughs> Ooh, baby, I worked on this makeup for real. So, all right, so it says, congratulations. Congratulations, Adina. Thank you for being an amazing inspiration, and may your creativity continue to unfold and open doors you never imagined. Enjoy these goodies, blessings, love, and light, Glamammy. And then it's got a scripture in here. I won't read that because then I'll start tearing up. So, let's get into the beautiful... I, I, I think she spent more time on the wrapping than she did on her actual giveaway because the giveaway happened so fast um, that she... The, I didn't even know she it was over. <laughs> Wow, she was not playing. She was like, Look, I got this stuff and I want for real. Got a phone call? No, no. Okay, so first thing I have is a bottle with and, uh, everything is wrapped up just like this uh, bubble wrap all around and the wrapping paper with the ribbons around it is really, really pretty. And it's like Christmas in it's August in all Christmas in August. So, oh, and if you're wondering about my music, it's from an uh, app called NCS. So that's uh, that, you know, royalty-free music thing. I, so I couldn't tell you what's all playing in the background, but I just like to have some music playing. So the first thing I have is this bottle. So I'm going to wrap that. And the hoarder in me wants to keep this uh, the ribbon. I'm such a hoarder. So, <laughs> so let's see what the first thing we have is. Oh my God, I love Nexus. I love that, like, the and it is a Humectris. Okay, so this is the Restoring Conditioner um, Nexus Salon Philosophy. Talking about that. It's a conditioner replenishing system. And this is step two. So, now what I will be doing, I'm glad that she sent me this. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to just shampoo my hair with my braids. Because I want to just leave them up for a little while. Even though you can see the rubber band right here. I'm so random. But anyway, the first thing that she gave me is some Nexus. And this stuff smells so good. I, that I do know. But this stuff smells... I love Nexus. Ah, Nexus shampoo, uh, conditioner. Okay, so the next thing, I'm trying to figure out how I want to do this. Because the next thing is a big box. And then I have two smaller boxes. So I think I'm going to open the this, this medium-sized box next. So let's pull off the ribbon here. And open. I can see what's in it, but I'm still gonna do the. I like opening like It's time for a fill in. This nail here is really hurting me because I hit it like really, really hard. This is Wildflowers for Sensitive Skin Mattifying Moisturizer with Red Poppy and Green Tea Extracts. Regulates oily skin to reduce shine and leaves skin radiant and smooth. Wildflowers natural skin care is formulated with naturally derived, chemically clean, paraben-free in ingredients for women with common needs. Anti-aging, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> yes. anti-acne prone and environmental damage. Uniquely blended with 12 essential wildflower extracts to boost radiance, add supreme nourishment, and moisturize sensitive skin. So, I really want to see what this looks like. So this one time that your stiletto type nails, you know, pointy nails come in handy is for stuff like this. So let's see what this is. Oh, it's okay. Oh, it's got a little pamphlet inside. So it says wildflowers for sensitive skin. Okay, so and it comes in a it's a pump. I don't know if you can see that. It's a pump. And after cleansing with Deep Daily Cream Cleanser, smooth over face and neck for shine-free hydration. Oh, okay, so it's a moisturizer, but it's mattifying. Okay, that's... 
I always wondered, haven't you always wondered how that works? That something can mattify because it's trying to tone down the oils, but it's still a moisturizer. Because, you know, I don't know if you know this, they're always talking about even if you do have oily skin, that you should still moisturize. So, I always wonder about that, and I never did it. I'm one of those people that looks everything up, but never looked that up. I guess I don't care about it that much. It's a big container, and we will take off the... Dun -dun -dun. Da -da 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 -da. So, this is... A case. Oh, it's sexy. Oh, look at the cute little charms. Isn't that cute? Oh my god. Okay, so this is What a Beauty, and it's a makeup case. And let's see what's inside. So it's, oh, and it's got some stuff inside, but it's got like a little bubble wrap it thing in so that it won't smush down. That is cute. But if she had put some. She was just really into wrapping. She probably needs to work in a wrapping. <gasps> okay, this is the Cantu Shea Butter Natural Hair Soul Fray Free Cleansing Cream Shampoo. And I do love this stuff because it smells so good. Mm. Have you all ever opened up something and the bubble came up and popped on your face? If that had happened right now, that would have just been a disaster for me because I'm not taking this makeup off. And then inside of that, she has... Oh, okay. It's some um, Milani Moisture Lock Grapeseed Oil Infused Lip Treatment. It says um, a burst of moisture trapping intense hydration for lips. Enhances natural lip color. Melts onto lips with a comforting feel and addictive scent. Benefits of grapeseed oil are infused with vitamin E, nourishes, and soothes. Wide Soft Plush Applicator. Wave goodbye to waxy bombs and heavy glosses. So I can't wait to try this out and I'll let you know how that is. But she also gave me a Milani a more Matte Lip Cream. And you all know I really like the matte lipsticks. This is so cute. It is a kind of shimmery blue. It's got these two cute little hearts. But I'm just loving these little charms. They're so adorable. This is such a nice case. I really love it. Okay, so I'm trying not to make this video long, and I'm trying not. To, oh, it was more stuff in here than I thought, because I thought it was just. I thought this was the last thing. I won't say that for last because I thought that that was the last thing. So I'm gonna say that for last. Okay, so then she gave me this, which I believe might be a palette. So let's see what's in it. And I feel like I'm taking clothes off of a stripper. <laughs> okay. So, what do we have in here? It's a palette. Ooh, it's the Go-To Palette by NYX. La Palette Indispensable. Highlight, accentuator, blush, eyeshadows. So, it's got everything in one. So, it says... Uh, Wonderlust. This is the Wonderlust uh, GTP01. Open that all the way up so we can take a look and see what's really inside this bad boy. Come on, baby. Open up. Acting like a virgin. Okay, so it's some really pretty peach shade. I love this right here. Oh my goodness, that's such a beautiful. Let's see what that looks like. Okay, so that's a soft blush. I don't, the thing is, swatching for me never works out good. I'm not a good swatcher. And I love these nude colors for the eyeshadow. I think they're really pretty. So it says that numbers 7, 8, and 9. 7, seven is this shade, this shade here is a highlighter. Number 8 is a blush. And number 9 is contouring. And these on this side are eyeshadows. So I can't wait to give that a whirl. Okay, so last but not least. That's it. That's it. So last but not least is this baby here. So I wanted to see what this was. Because I thought this was the bottom of the box. But that was off to the side. So I can't wait to try that out. Because I really do like mixed products. So let's see what's in this. Oh, it's a detangler. Oh my goodness, I love these kind of combs. But I got braids now. Now see, I have to hide this now from my daughter because, and yes, I'm selfish. Call me selfish. 
tell her to enter a giveaway. This is mine. Mine, mine, mine. Have you all ever seen Finding Nemo? And <laughs> the seagulls are talking mine, mine. That's me right now. I'm going to stab the mess out of myself. Yes, this is mine. My daughter already comes in here and takes my stuff. But this she won't be taking. So the brand, is, I believe, is called Revel. Revel. Detangling comb. Sturdy conditioning comb. Detangles hair without breakage. Wiley Space teeth are designed for a smooth glide. Used to apply conditioner evenly. And I could probably use it to comb out my shampoo. So, and it's in French in the back. I don't speak a lick of French, and you know what? I won't even try, and there's a reason why behind it, but I won't tell you about the reason why. But it's a wide tooth detangling comb. So, those were my goodies from Glam Mammy Artistry. She took really good care of me, and thank you for your awesome giveaway. It was really awesome. I think you have like the cutest stuff in here. I love cute stuff. And your packaging. Oh my goodness. I loved it if for nothing else for the packaging. Now I will use this when I take my braids down to comb my hair out. And I'll just be combing. And I'll be. And then I'll be combing. And I'll be shampooing. Yes, I'm going to be doing all of that. But I have to. At this point, I have to hide this. Thank you for this. That now I have to hide it from my child. You all know her. I don't hide her, but I'm going to have to hide my comb. So, I loved all of my items. I hope this video wasn't too long. I hope I got through it pretty fast and I didn't bore anybody. So, anyway, please, I'm going to put her name right here again. Hopefully, before I post this video, she has sent me her link to her YouTube channel. So, I hope everyone has a wonderful day. I was off from work today. So, I stayed home and I... I tried to do some stuff, but anyway, I stayed home, and I hope everybody had a great day. Always remember, be beautiful and be good. Bye.